Here we're going to have another one of my cute little demonstrations. What this one's about is a conduction of heat through a solid material and the differences between different materials. I'm using metals here. I've got a steel, uh, essentially wire, and a copper wire. They're both going to be in a flame. Now let's look closer here. Okay, here's my steel wire. This is a copper wire. Now they're going to move heat at different rates. Now, obviously I've got a burner there that I'm going to turn on. They go into the same flame, you know, pretty much identical. Then, over here, I have a thermometer. And there's two probes. One probe is saying 65.5. The other one's saying 66. So they're pretty much the same. In the center, I'm going to set up a time clock. So I'm going to go ahead and turn on the flame onto these things and start the time clock. And let's see the difference between one and the other one of these pieces of wire. And you can see right here, I've got the probes placed at the ends of those wires. Now those wires are the same diameter, they're the same length, and the probes are placed at the same place on the wire. So the only difference here is going to be how fast one moves heat over the other. Okay, we're all set up. I'm starting the timer. Turn on the burner. Now what's the most important thing is what's happening on this. Okay, after 40 some seconds, we're at 88, 90, coming up pretty fast here. But on the steel wire, we're still back, you know, in the 70s. Remember, we started out at 60, I think it's 65 or 66. Okay, it's slowly moving up. But look what's happening on the copper side. Now, another little illustration. Notice the steel wire is glowing red hot. The copper is not. And that's because the copper is moving heat faster. Now let's take a look over at the thermometer again. Okay, we're at almost too well. We're at 200 degrees on the copper and we're at 80 degrees on the steel. Now this is a pretty good demonstration. This pretty much tells it. Right now, 218 to 82. That's the difference. It's over twice as hot at the other end as the steel wire is. So does copper move heat faster than steel? Obviously much, much faster. And I think that's pretty much good enough for that one.